Hi GDs, welcome back to my channel. And sorry I didn't upload within the past four days. I had some personal things going on and sometimes that can get in the way, but let's just go ahead and jump right into the video. So today is just basically going to be another flyer design. So and basically it's going to be it's going to be a shop now, pay later flyer design. So that's what I would be creating for y'all today. And I hope y'all enjoy it. And please watch till the end because I will be giving my shout out at the end of this video. So please watch to the end. Let's go ahead and get started here. But the well not but the first thing I want to do is go ahead and pick out my background. I know for sure I want like a money background. So I'm going to scroll down because I already recently used it. So I have my money background right here. And I want to go to elements. Scroll up. Click that. Drag that over here. If it do right, if it does right. And I want to take this. Put it over like that. I want to change it to the color pink. But I got to see like the exact pink it is that I want to use. I always use like this color pink, but let me go ahead and type in the exact code that I want to use. So I have my code written down here. So for when I do the video, I will know the exact color code to use. So yeah, and that's my code. Let me hit enter. So I have that and what I want to do is go to my transparency and take it down some, maybe like that, maybe like an 80, 85, uh, I think that would be good. So I have that. What I want to do, you don't have to do it exactly like this, but this is my way of how I want to do mine. You don't have to do it from step to step like this, but I just want to show you exactly how you can do yours, you know. Matter of fact, let me make this a little bit bigger so y'all can see better. Oh, that's, yeah. Okay, so I have that. I didn't want this being too big. I mean, too wide. Okay, so I think that right there is good enough. I did want to hold on do, 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 do. now it wants to do it hmm. but anyways we're just going to go to that same one and just drag it down i might have to take the screen and make it like a 43 so yeah we have that And if you want to know how I found this, I just typed in silver. And that's all. And I will be having like different content coming sooner or later to this channel. So yeah. I will. Surely. Oh, why did I delete that? Because rather y'all know it or not, once you create a YouTube channel. Like I'm most most of my videos is going to be like for um it's going to be based on graphics because it's it's never stopping with the graphics. So my most of my content will be based on graphics. But what I wanted to let y'all know is that um did I want to use this one? Okay, so we we can do that. We can do that. <clears throat> But um, but what I want to let y'all know is, I think I want to you no, we could just keep it like that. Um, well, I, sorry, I keep getting distracted. But what I want to let y'all know is that yeah, I would be bringing different content every now and then, because with having a YouTube channel, trust and believe me, whether you know it or not. Yeah, you get those sponsorships. So if you know what I know, 
Hmm. Go ahead and make that YouTube channel. So yeah. And even if you're not even monetized yet, or even making like if you're not monetized, like if if you don't even have like your four thousand hours or your um one thousand um subscribers, you can still be making money up here. You really can. And once you do hit your own um, do get all everything that you need up here, you can still make money on top of the sponsorships or whatever it is you're making your money from. So trust and believe me, the money is there. Some people just give up too quick and not, I don't know, but all I got to say is just don't give up because the opportunities is there. So don't give up. So the next thing I want to do here is go to my Afterpay. Well, go and find my Afterpay because you or you can put um you can put Afterpay, ShopPay, or whatever it is you're looking for for that shop now. Pay later, as you can see, I have Sizzle, uh, ShopPay, but I'm looking for my Afterpay, and I know I saw it in here, so I'm looking for that ShopPay. I'm looking for my After, I mean not yeah Afterpay. And that one, I think it was in all oh, there you go, right here. So I have my after pay. I want this in the middle, like that. But I also want like uh, maybe like some kind of shadow behind it. So I'm gonna do like a drop shadow, like that, because I just don't want it. Looking too plain, you know. And I want to bring it down a little. So the next thing I want to do is just go to my text and just simply click on that one. I want to drag it up and I'm going to type in. Oh, it does this every time. Usually, when you click on it and yeah, go ahead and just start typing right away. So I got shop now here. And I want this like in the middle, like right here maybe. I don't want it too, too big because I have to have like some room at the bottom for something else. I want to take that space in. But yeah, girl, go ahead and make that YouTube channel. Mm-hmm. I, I promise you, it will pay off in the long run. Shop now. Pay later. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, y'all, the opportunities are really out there. You just got to learn to just stay consistent with whatever you're doing because i noticed like at the beginning like when i first started my youtube channel like i i posted like one video then i post another video probably like a month later and yeah i was seeing like a few subscribers here and there because actually the first video that i did upload it took off it, and it's still doing good to this day it's doing very good and i literally got like 10 10k no 11k yeah 11k like no it's 11 yeah 11k views on it and like 400 likes on it so yeah that and that was basically the very first video that i had uploaded to my youtube channel like i said and it's doing very good so yeah but let me continue like when i first started i wasn't consistent at all i'm like i'm i don't post like a, every two weeks or every three weeks or whatever being lazy with it and i was like you know what let me see what can happen if i do decide to stay consistent and actually like take it serious and that's exactly what i did and once i did do that my channel took off and i got to my one well, 1000 followers in no time so i'm um, saying that to say this stay consistent and i promise you you will see the results it may take some time but just stay consistent and i promise you will see them results i promise you and you will see the difference you go and then you'll be like wow so yeah 
I promise you. That's like I have like I'm in I have this like group chat and not group chat, but I have my like group on Facebook. It's called Digital Bosses. And I'm pretty sure some of my subscribers um came from my group chat. Not my group chat, I don't know why I keep saying that. Not my group chat, but my um group on Facebook or whatever. So yeah. And basically like some every now and then I go and po post like my video in the group and let them know like oh well, I made this video so and so and so so y'all go and check it out so the members in my group yeah they part of it too and they help me out a lot a whole lot so I'm going to just go to and click that text and just type in you no know, interest no please but yeah and i have seen so many people like start on things and then they never finish them and then you next thing you know and i'm like wow you could you could have really solved the results if you would have just continued to do what you was doing and you really could have solved the results if you would have just continued But I have that right here. I think I want to bring everything down some. I might have to make this a little bigger because it's kind of small. So I have that. I don't want everything pushed to the top like that. Okay, so I want to go back to my elements. I'm going to click on that. I'm trying to make everything blend in together. So I have that one, I have this one, and I'm going to add another one right there. Then I want to go back to my elements, get that circle outline, and I'm going to line them up with each circle. But I'm going to have to zoom in real quick, y'all, because this thing gets tedious. Um, uh, come on. And I hope y'all enjoyed my talk with y'all trying to make it like a motivational talk for y'all. And I really hope y'all will enjoy. Let me know if y'all would like to continue me like doing the mo motivational talks for y'all or whatever. Or find something else to talk about. So yeah, I have that and <clears throat> I'm going back to my elements. I already have like the icons that I want to use for my um flyer but for this one i just basically put in shopping cart and you can just go go to your elements type in shopping cart and it will come right on up so i have that right there i want to go and find my other element which is going to be right here i got to change this to that's not like a more like a very dark gray color so i changed it to black and that's what color i need it to be so i have that one then the next thing i want to do is go and find the card icon with a debit card icon and if y'all want to know yes i have like a, um like before i do these videos i already have like the flyer made and i look at it from my phone basically so that's basically how I do it so I don't forget any steps. So what I want to do, I'm going to go and add another text like under here. And uh, this one is basically going to say shop. So you have shop right there. I'm going to make this in bold. I don't know why I didn't do it. There we go. So we have shop. Then I'm going to put another word on this one. This one is going to say ship. I'm going to make that O. I'm going to add another word. This one is going to say pay. Make that bold. And if you want to basically describe uh, like how to do this um, steps, 
under this you can but i'm gonna just leave it like this but that's not the only thing that i'm going to leave but you could basically put some more words on it on there like you could shop now you could tell them just add items to the cart and so on so on and so on basically describing what they need to do to have that shop now pay later option but i'm just going to go back to my elements hit the icon and uh put that right here for instagram copy this i might have to have to make that a little bit smaller and this one is basically going to say at your instagram so you will put your instagram handle right here like I said, I'm going to have to make this a little bit smaller. So I got that. The next thing I want to do is <clears throat> go and find my website icon right there. So I didn't mean to. Oh, I had it right over the word. So right here, um, basically just going to put, I don't want it too, too big. I'm just going to add another word. Sorry, this is taking too long, y'all, but I'm trying to get everything lined up correctly. So right here, you're just going to put your website. So that's basically what you'll put. So it'll be www, whatever your website address is. So yeah, I don't like that because I want it in the middle. There we go. Nope. There we go. So we have that one. This is not lined up. I want this bold and I want this bold. So I'm going to take this up because I, my stuff got to be in like at least in the middle. Okay, so now we about finished, y'all. We about finished. Just hold on, hold on. Okay, so there we have it. That's the um the after pay shop now pay later flyer, and I hope you enjoyed it. And I really love how this turned out. So yeah, I really enjoyed that one. But let me go ahead and give my shout out here. I'm scrolling through my phone trying to find it so y'all bear with me please okay and my new shout out or well, my shout out goes to your social bay and she put hi rosie your new subscriber here just wanted to let you know that i love your work keep shining like your creatives thank you so much for the kind words and i truly mm -hmm. appreciate it thank you again and y'all keep leaving the positive comments if you have any questions please leave them down below in the comments and i just love the support i don't want to rant too much or whatever so i'm gonna just go ahead and just say thank y'all for watching if you're new here please go ahead and subscribe like comment and share this video and the same goes for my subscribers thank y'all again for watching and god bless